Hey guys, Kirby Kid here. Uh, it's it's 2 a.m. I just got back from seeing Star Wars Rogue One. I liked it. At least the initial reaction is I liked it. We're going to be doing a, uh, a bigger review, uh, probably full of spoilers, with uh, me, Black Superman, and Simply Cedric. Uh, God willing, tomorrow night. <laughs> uh, and we're, we're going to give you guys some time to go see it, but then we're going to be putting up the full spoiler review, but just, you know, no spoilers, just with, just so you guys know, it, it, it was, it was entertaining, it was good, there's no opening crawl, like every other Star Wars movie has, which was, it felt a little weird, but outside of that, uh, it, it, it was a good movie, um, one cool thing is that with, uh, with Grand Moff Tarkin and, and Leia, they use CGI, so that, instead of finding stand-in actors, they just got the old people, basically, via computer magic. So I thought that was really cool. Um, Vader was awesome, and it, it really does, le it, it leaves off right where New Hope happens. And uh, I, 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 it was it was really cool. I like being, I like, you know, the, the, the connection there. It was, it, it was really, it was really fun to see. Um, I, obviously there's no after credit scene guys, um, spoiler alert, the sequel is A New Hope. I mean, like, there's no chance for an in-between movie. I mean, it really is, the end of Rogue One happened, and then, like, seconds later, Leia is gonna be sending out the transmission to Obi-Wan, so, <laughs> don't look, don't say after the credits, there's nothing there. But, yeah, that's it, guys, I have to go to bed, because I actually have work tomorrow, but, uh, until our full review... Which go see it until our full review. Uh, I've been your host, Kirby Kid. And may the force be with you. Or night, Dave. That was too lame. <laughs>